Yo, what's up, YouTube? I'm back with another video. I know y'all seen. Y'all probably wondering what's going on right now. Well, before we do that, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, subscribe to the channel, and share the video. Do all that good stuff. Make sure y'all follow me on my social medias: Instagram yt underscore t loading, uh, Twitter and Twitter and TikTok t loading underscore. Make sure y'all follow me and subscribe to the channel. Come on, do that for me. Do me that favor. Anyway, what we doing today's video? I end up uh. We gonna have Steph Curry drop into the 1991 season and see how well can he be? Is he can he be uh is he the best scorer? Can he be the best scorer in that era for the 1990 for the 19 uh damn for the 91 season? Can he be the best player? Can he be better than Michael Jordan? Can he outshoot everybody? Cause you know he's gonna take a lot of attempts shooting. So we're gonna drop. We're gonna see what he uh what place he end up going to. Bank the Grizzlies. So the Steph Curry is on the Grizzlies right now the worst team in nba season so far not after the 1991 season but i don't think i realized how much uh effort and stuff was to this video because i'll let y'all see that because bro i had to switch all these teams names to that put the jersey on there and stuff bro do all that crazy shit make it look somewhere real so for the video bro i like y'all i like doing this shit so we end up seeing send them so advance to next season and see how well can he be in the 1990s? Cause y'all know, y'all know they be like, they all rough stuff ass up and shit. We'll see. Is it true? Whatever. Can they rough him up? Is he is he gonna be scared to play against the big boys, motherfuckers that brought guns, drugs, and all that different type of stuff in the locker room? We'll see. Vancouver. All right, here's Steph Curry's teammates right here. You got Steph Curry running the point, 97 overall. We put we end up putting up him uh, in his prime, by the way. Allen Weber, don't know who that is. Uh, Hammonds, don't know who that is. Warren Kelly, we don't know. Rose Cheeks, <laughs> Ross Cheeks, we all know who that is, but he's Cheeks, of course. And I'm going to let y'all see the uh, other rosters. I'm with Slim. I'm going to let y'all go through, let y'all see that. Dominique Wilkins, Eddie Johnson, Carl Malone, and John Sarkton. Uh, Mo Cheek, Mo Cheek, right? Marcy, Maurice Cheeks. My bad, we got Magic in here. Kareem retired. Or was that? I can't remember. We got Glenn Rice in here. Nick Anderson. Dennis Scott, too. Fat Lever. That boy can shoot that thing. Uh, we got P. Maravich. Um, Reggie Miller. We got Isaiah Thomas. Nobody right there. David Robinson. We got Danny Manning. I don't know how. We got Sean, Kevin, Gary, and GP. Uh, we got Kyle Drexler. Okay. Tim Hardaway, Chris Mullen, and uh, Mitch Richmond. Yes, sir. And I appreciate our Doc Rivers right there. Yes, sir. And we got that. And then there we go. So I'm, I'm going to end up simming the first we're gonna send the first three weeks of the NBA season. See how well stuff doing. And I'll catch y'all. Oh, hold on, hold on. Before I do that, before I do that. Let's make sure this dude Steph is getting his minutes. I really want to see. Could these players, well, you see an X Series deck? Uh, I don't know what the the dude who made this, like what he did, but like he did not put any, any players for the Vancouver Grizzlies. So, yeah, so these, these players are ass, basically. So, Steph Curry gonna try to carry. Uh, so let me fix this manually. All right, quick. Where they ass anyway, so shit. It don't matter. All right, now let's send the first uh, three weeks of the NBA season. We know, well, like, okay, we we losing real bad. Like, damn, god damn, nigga, can we win the game? We lost ten. We lost ten straight. Uh, Steph Curry, first game of the nineteen ninety one season, nineteen ninety through ninety no, nineteen ninety through nineteen ninety one season. He shot two for fourteen. God damn, nigga. Second game, he ended up having thirty one, much better game. Yo, third game. He ended up getting yeah, 36. He can't carry these AIs though. Uh, 26. How much he had? 23. Nothing. He nothing too spectacular yet. To be honest, I think he had a terrible game right there. That's the game we probably could have won too against the uh, Timberwolves. He ended up having 16. Bro, Curry our best player. Why he not getting a ball more? 
Like now, nigga, shoot that bit. Yeah, we we looking bad right now. We we even look bad against Tratchy Magic, bro. All right, so I'm gonna end up simming the uh the first. Well, yeah, look, we'll send first half of the season. I don't care about awards. Listen, all right, we are back. We end up being nine forty nine. By the way, this is not a team team type of thing video. This is an individual type of thing. So don't worry about the record, though. Do not worry about that. We here for the Steph Curry, bro. How well can he do in the nineties? Right now, he's averaging twenty points per game with six rebounds, four assists. Shooting 52%, 45% from the three-point line, and 94% uh, from the free throw. Let's see. Uh, damn. Let's see. Scoring-wise, top leader, the top leader in scoring is Michael Jordan, of course. Steph Curry is top five, so that's not bad. And in, in the NBA now, he probably like Steph Curry probably like top 20, top 30 if you average 20, just like playing 20. But you know, the, the NBA era is different. Low scoring, not shooting as many threes, taking twos. So, you know, let's see, let's see, can let's see his uh, stats during the uh, when the season over because we know we're not making the playoffs. All right, all right. So our record was 56, 15 and sixty seven. I wish it was sixty something. Anyway, MVP Terry Porter. Damn, what happened to Michael Jordan? He was scoring all them points. Steph Curry, I guess he didn't wear rookie of the year. Dale Williamson, who the fuck that is? Random AI, random uh NPC. Dar Rivers has been the sixth man of the year. Michael Jordan ended up being defensive player of the year. Damn. Michael Jordan got a hold out of that MVP. Look at his stats and look at his stats. Wow. Cliff Robinson is most improved. Coach of the year is Danum. Hey, bro, you might be a bitch for all I know. I really don't know with that first name, bro. Come on now. Uh, Did Steph make NBA first team? No, he didn't. All right, we really don't care about that. We're here for stuff. Let's see how many points that boy averaged this season. Averaged 21, 58, I mean, 21, 6 assists, uh, I mean, 6 rebounds, 4.6 assists, shot 52% from the uh, field, 43% from the three-point line, and 94 from free throw. Now, let's compare his stats to other people's stats in the 90s right quick. I didn't mean hit that. So Michael Jordan ended up keeping his uh, 26.3 points per game. But where's Curry? Right here. Um let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Where's the three points attempted? Alright. Curry attempted 8.5 threes each game, most likely, or more higher, obviously. He averaged that. He he uh, attempted that. The ones he made, the three pointers he made was like 3.7. That's like the best. That's like the best uh, makes besides Ray J. Miller uh, making 3.5 uh, three points per game. Besides that, him and Reggie was the only one shooting the lights out. Oh, also Glenn Rice was my bad. Put some respect on his name. I think he, him and Curry shot about the same threes per game, but he only made uh, he made higher threes during that during Steph Curry. But besides that, them three players was the only one shooting the light out. But besides, if Curry wasn't here, Reggie Miller and Glenn Rice be shooting lights out in the 90s. Besides that, there was no three-point shooters. I'm gonna end up simming. I'm gonna end up doing one more season with Steph Curry to see uh, can he play better or something. Besides that, bro, I like I like what I'm seeing because he's not even scoring the ball a lot, but he's still like top five in scoring, which is crazy. If you think about that nowadays, he'd probably be like top twenty or top thirty because a lot of people in the NBA now average like twenty points per game. All right, the uh, Pistons end up winning the NBA Finals against the Blazers, which I don't care about. Good for them, but we're here for Curry. So we'll end up simming to next season. I'll see y'all next season. After simming the first half of the season, we did get more wins than we had last season at 18 wins right now, 18 and 39. Let's see what Steph Curry doing, obviously. Um, right now he got 18.5 points per game, bro. Like, what is going on with Steph right now? Shooting 50%, shooting 51%. 44% from the three point line, 91% from the free throw line. Like, what is going on? I thought he'd be scoring crazy. Is he getting minutes? He's getting his minutes. So, what's the problem? Let's see the lead leaders. I forgot how many points he's averaging. He averaged 18.5 points. Imagine Steph Curry averaging 18.5 points in today's game. But the Warriors not doing nothing. And he not getting top. And he not getting top ten in scoring if he averaged eighteen point five, which is crazy. Which is crazy. Uh, let's see how many three pointers he attempted so far in the first half of the season. He attempted attempted 
7.1 and made 3.1. Uh, already, he shot, he made more threes than uh, Reggie Miller so far and attempted more. What about Glenn Rice? Where Glenn Rice? Glenn, where are you? All right, Glenn, and up. Damn, let me get you nine threes per game. Made four. God damn. Curry, step your shit up, nigga. You getting your shit out of dudes right now. Him and Reggie Miller showing the same. No, nah, he's showing 1% higher than Reggie Miller, 44. What about Glenn Rice? Where he at? Shooting, Glenn Rich showing 45. What? Well, he's showing 45. Yeah. Damn. So step your shit up, bro. I'm going to see him to the uh, end of the season because we know damn well we ain't made in the playoffs. We just here to see what, what uh, Steph's stats is compared to these other players. All right, I'm back. We ended up getting 30 wins, which is crazy. All right, anyway, Pooh Richardson Jr. What type of fucking name is that? Ended up winning MVP. You tell me he won MVP. I swear, if Michael Jordan won a defensive player of the year but not MVP, bro, there's something wrong with 2K. Uh, we don't worry about that. Six man of the year, uh, him. All right, anyway. Michael Jordan ended up winning a defensive player of the year, averaging 26 points per game. Five rebounds, uh, five assists, 2.4 steals, a block, showing 54%, 77% from the free throw line, 39% from three point line. How is he not the MVP, but fucking Pooh is? Fucking Pooh Shiesty is your uh, MVP. Like, how does that make sense? Era Fuller is your uh, most improved, and Brad Nelson is your coach of the year, which we don't care about, bro. How is he better than. My okay, I'm not gonna, like, what, like, like, the scoring don't even matter in this game. We're, oh, bro, we might, bro, next time we might have to drop Luca in here. I'm not going to lie to you. We might have to drop Luca in here. We're going to send it. Uh, Anyway, y'all seen how many points Steph Curry out oh, right, right now? Damn, I forgot. Pistons end up winning the championship again, which I don't care about. They end up meeting meet the Blazers again. Uh, Steph Curry ended up averaging 19 points per game, shooting 51% from the field, 44% from the three-point line, 93% uh, 3 from the free throw line. Anyway. I'm gonna show y'all something right quick. Fuck that. Alright. Alright, look at this. Michael Jordan averaged 31.3 points per game. Oh, that's playoffs. Hold up. Okay, anyway. Damn. I wish I can see. Alright, so what I'm gonna do? What I'm gonna do? So I know y'all seen that. Steph Curry was top 10 in scoring, but only at the first half of the season, he only averaged 18.5 points per game. Michael Jordan had like 26.3 while everybody was like 20s or mid 20s or like, like 15. Like, imagine that in the NBA today. Like, Steph Curry would not be top 10 in the scoring. These other players, like, that would not happen. And only like three players have the whole NBA is tempting like seven or more threes a game, but making like five, like three or four of them per game. Like, imagine that Steph Curry, dang, like, he was looking like a fraud in the, 90, in the 90s right now. He could not do nothing. He cannot average 25 points per game, bro. But one thing, he did average 25 points per game. Let me explain to y'all. Because when I before I was test running this, uh, first time I test running this, without the uh, team logos and all that, he had 30.6 points per game. But he was not the MVP of the uh, regular season. It was uh, Michael Jordan, what Michael Jordan won, the used to play of the year, all that. I wish I would have said that. But for real, though. But for right now, what we looking at video time, that boy is looking like a bum. Like, Michael Jordan, the, uh, the leap over Michael Jordan compared to everybody else was insane. I thought Steph Curry was going was gonna to be able to keep up because the way he shoot threes, all that. Probably if I, uh, probably if I dropped him to the Warriors on his regular team with uh, Mitch Richman, uh, Chris Mullen, and uh, what's that nigga name? Chris? Like Chris Mullen, uh, like it's on the tip of my tongue. Tim Hardaway, there we go. Like if I dropped him, he probably would have averaged more points, obviously. But what's one that we know put him in a draft to see where he get drafted? Can he hang with the '90s players? And he didn't, obviously. Like we expected him to. If y'all like this video? Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, share the video, comment, do all that good stuff. Make sure y'all follow me on my social media, YT underscore T Load, and that's my Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter is uh, T Load underscore. Have a good uh, weekend. I'll see y'all later.